Hello everyone. Ooh, I forgot to turn my mic around. Hang on. Because I'll get carried away later on and forget about this. There we go. <coughs> there we go. We're gonna start after doing something a bit different. We're gonna sell the Toyota. We're gonna sell the Hilux. Why is the music so insanely loud today? There we go. Just come back for your dinner, monster? Awesome. Why is... There we go. What am I doing today? I have no idea. I haven't planned it. Um, I have zero plans for the day. Apart from this one thing that I need to do. One thing I need to do. Uh, I will be doing a mod list eventually. I uh, just need to arrange stuff first. I'm working on a whole bunch of stuff. Ooh, stop. Hello, Mark. I'm doing good. And George. As if you're playing Farmson at the moment, feel free to be quiet. Don't feel like you're being rude. We are going to sell off this Toyota Hilux. Because... I found something better. Something that actually has a turning circle. So let's sell that for 50,000. And hopefully it's going to be in... Hopefully I remember to add it into the game. Should be in cars, yes. Land Rover 109. Now we have a fitting car. Oh dear, they didn't fix the suspension on this thing. There. Only one way to find out. No, well, yeah, they did. This thing has a fixed suspension now. But now we've got a lovely little runabout to uh, help us with our little chores and whatnot. How's it going today? It's going good. This Land Rover, for some reason, does in fact have a PTO shaft, which... I'm not too happy with. I've never seen a Land Rover with a PTO before, but apparently this has one. So... Deal with it, I guess, is the, the word of the day. <coughs> what time alive till? Uh, seven, I guess. That'll do. You've seen Land Loser PTOs? Oh. Military ones have them. Well, this, uh, this is civilian. It's also st struggling quite badly. I think it may lack rear suspension now. I may have... I may have killed the rear suspension on this thing. But hey, it made it to where it needed to go. Um, next on the agenda... 
We'll be getting the Massey. Reattaching the bale forks. Detaching the baler. <coughs> what time did I start today? Uh, like five minutes ago. Where did I put the bale trailer? Here it is. Because I think today we're going to make some mixed rations for the cows. Um, that sounds like a good plan to me. Which means we'll need to pick up the hay bales over here. And, uh, yeah, that's a, yeah, let's make some mixed rations. That may require a shorter bale trailer. Yep. So you'd leave early. That's, that's fine. I don't mind you leaving early if you have to. How am I today? Are you talking to me or is there another Dave in chat? <laughs> I'm feeling good today. Hey, Tommy. Oh, yeah, I forgot the hedges are non-collidable. So if I can't get through the gate this time, I'll just drive through the hedge. Come on. Have I spoken to Freaks? Who's Freaks? I, I don't know a Freaks. <laughs> could, you, could you kindly explain to me who Freaks is? <laughs> is White Oak is still in 17 going to be released? I don't know. It, it, um, Nathan said it will be eventually, but I presume so. Oh, fresh eggs. I uh, haven't spoken to him in a little while now. I'd imagine he's feeling slightly better. Hey, JD Keen. Who calls fresh eggs freaks? There we go. How's my day going? Uh, yes. <coughs> How are you doing? I'm doing good today. I, uh, may have found the source of my cough. So I'm gonna avoid it as much as possible. <laughs> it's not bales. Yeah, maps are few in the, and far between at the moment, guys. Which is a bit of a shame. Um... I worked my magic, JD. Also known as I made a joke and got it like two seconds later. Uh, what time am I going on at? Oh, you're talking to Irish. It's like I'm, I'm on already. Oh, Dan had the same idea as me. <laughs> it's, I don't get why people do that. Just start. No. Uh, you're 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 only wasting your own time when you start spamming like that. Because I see all the I see every message in the chat pretty much. I see pretty much every message in chat. I just choose to ignore quite a lot of them. Or not reference them because they're just hellos. In which case, well, the hellos I don't mind. <laughs> <coughs> the source of my cough ATS, no. It is actually, where is it? Believe it or not, this thing. I've been doing this too much. Let me see if I do another multiplayer. Yes! Um. 
There's just a load of issues with that at the moment. Sims, super busy. Fahey's got Spudnet. And uh, I am also surprisingly super busy. Um, just trying to arrange all different... Like, with two multiplayer series, it, it becomes a lot harder. Especially with one where it's it's different people every week, so you have to accommodate a different timetable every week, and then forget to invite people, and then invite two people in the same week, so... Speaking of, <laughs> come Saturday, I'll have next week's video ready. <coughs> Isn't it anything whatever for you? Um, probably, except that's not water vapor, that's oil. It's like an alcoholic oil, so they can get uh, through. Any good British maps out? Not at the moment, Liam. Um, there's a few going through testing. There's Sutton, actually. Sorry, I stand corrected. There's Sutton, which is available on Nathan's website. Um, Nathan's website should, hopefully, if YouTube bothered to update it, be in the description. Make a map. Why, why should I, John Deere? Why are you, why are you making demands of me? That's not a good idea. Isn't there any type of liquid bands on your own? Yes. Yeah, Sun's a good map, but there's no animals of, as of yet. Do I know if Landy's live tonight? I don't know anything today, George. Um. Well, I know a lot of stuff, most of which I can't talk about. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff been uh, going on in the background that I can't talk about because it's private and not public and whatever. <coughs> some of it is quite exciting, some of it is um, just kind of people providing updates to things. Some of it, yeah, there's some exciting stuff in the pipeline um, in the farm sim world. <coughs> I know they sound a bit down today, it's just that I'm. Um, I'm not down, I'm, ju I'm just. My voice is kind of weird. You're an atheist and forget I was live. Well, I only went live like 15 minutes ago, so it's fine. Hello, Farming Pro 123 and Frank. Zach's landscaping. Do I know when Catlin Crops comes out? Um, I know that the early access version is coming out in March. I don't know what date. I know that the full version is scheduled for about a year's time. Again, I don't know what date. <coughs> Where's the music? It's playing in the background, Nathan. Um, Unfortunately, the way that my media player works, it doesn't particularly um, balance very well. Have the cows improved? I don't know yet, Dan. Um, that's why I'm actually making TMR, to, uh, get, or at least preparing to make um, food for the cows today. Because there are cows on the map. be a long wait? Yeah. <coughs> what editing software do I use? Uh, Adobe Premiere. Which is quite good. Um, there's a lot. Of, you know, it, it basically depends on what... Editing software is weird. It's basically whatever you suits you best, not what is best. What is Cattle and Crops about? Uh, it's about 33 euro. At the moment, if you want to quote unquote pre order it and give them some crowdfunding, uh, it's another, it's a new farming simulator game on the horizon, and it looks like of the um, kind of class of 2017, which is 
uh, FS17, pure farming 17, and cattle and crops. Well, and I guess farm expert as well would fall under that. Um, professional farmer. Yeah, cattle crops looks the most promising. Farm sim right now is the top dog. Um, cattle and crops though looks very promising. Did I see the new Chellington? Yes. Um, I've actually been talking to Landy about it quite a lot. Because he's... I'm helping him diagnose issues with it so that it can help Oxygen David. So if he finds an issue... <coughs> uh, so, okay. Full disclosure, I do actually know quite a bit about mapping and uh, map making. So... Uh, occasionally, if Landy or Silver have an issue with a map, they will come to me and say, Hey, do you know if you can do this in Giant Cedra? Um, and I'll usually give them a yes-no answer. Um, if it's yes, I'll explain it. If it's no, I'll just say, well, you're screwed. Um, so, you know, if they're trying to do anything at all, I'll get... Yeah, test, 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 test. And testing is absolutely key. And by the way, you can see that I did fix the uh, Miracle Square over here. It now has grass. <coughs> so, well, apparently, you know, it's all a part of testing is just find the little problems and... Sometimes they're not even visible, like... And then, sometimes one tester can say a problem and, ooh. <laughs> How on earth? That's a really weird glitch. And that's not a problem with the map, that's a problem with the game. If you look over at the right when I was doing that, you would have seen some really funky issues going on with the field. Tractor looks very light. Yeah, it's good. Ooh. It's a good way for doing this. It's heavy enough. Do I use a joystick? Not at the moment, um, because I forgot to... Yet again, I forgot to change the sensitivity of my joystick. Um, it's quite good. Okay, I've... Just... No. Not dealing with that. <laughs> hey, Amster. Um... Joysticks can be a bit weird. It depends on the joystick and how the game responds to the joystick. There's no, like, blanket answer I can give. Send me an email about Discord on my server. Yeah, ATS AI is... needs work. You've kind of got your mod thing fixed. Oh, are you having the issue where you, your mod tools are broken? Because um, the solution to that is to literally not use YouTube Gaming, which is dumb. Hey, Thomas. And Heinz. Welcome back. In fact, Heinz, you were here. Uh, you're here most days now. Ooh, ooh. I've given myself nowhere near enough room, so I'm going to... Do a vehicle swap, real quick. That's not what I want to disconnect. That's also not what. I That's what I wanted to disconnect. You fixed if you don't pop out yet. Yeah, that seems to be another thing that causes it. Why did I drive through a bush? Because I can. Um, because the trailer is too long to actually work correctly. Basically. <laughs> Oh, it was an MP pilot car. 
Yeah, they're just as bad as AI. So what I'm going to do is, um, let's get two buckets of silage into that, actually. Can I get some new equipment? Uh, no, because I barely had this equipment, George. You come in here every time and ask for new equipment. Stop. Just, just stop doing that, please. Can I please send a reply? Not now. Put two buckets of silage in and see what happens here. <laughs> Amps just playing around with the blacklist again. That's going to end badly for you and you know it. <coughs> Grizzly didn't put collisions on the hedges and it's very difficult to do it. Now am I? I'm pretty good. Um, but the way I play farm sim, I don't buy new and uh, new equipment much. I tend to use stuff until it's no longer viable as equipment, and then I'll buy something new. Dang it! It's I now, isn't it? So we do have some cows. I might get more today. I wonder is this like pigs? Apparently not. What's the best mod about Firefly 17? There aren't many. So uh, whatever one you can find is probably the best at the moment. Did that go on the blacklist? Yeah, that's that's blacklisted hamster. Can I get tanked or no? I can't afford it. Um, plus, it's way too big for this this style of map. There's no MT eight hundreds in the UK. I show the map. Yep, there's the uh, the full map. Um, there are currently no, unfortunately, no uh, grain selling triggers on the map. That's something Nathan said he's going to fix in the next version. Um, as well as a couple of other things that I can't remember he said he'd fix, but... Where's the blacklist? It's in YouTube. I'm not gonna ever show anybody the blacklist. Um, the blacklist is for words that I don't want to see. So there's gonna be no public list of it. Especially seeing as 90% of it is not in any way PG. 90% <coughs> of it isn't PG. The other 10% is just stuff that I don't want to see. <laughs> There's a big challenger. Yeah, that's probably a 700 flow tech. Um, the 800 series is literally too wide to fit into any British or Irish road. I think it's actually too wide to be legal in the UK and Ireland. So if you're wondering what's popping up every time I hit I... Um... Ace, the answer to that is no and will always be no. There's never going to be a mod map for uh, 360 uh, Farm Sim 15. So I've got the game extension by Zentro. And, uh. I did, yeah, I do need to remap that. But that's something I can fix later on. How much silage do the cows actually take? Good lord. Oh, I can see in the menu, can't I? 
silage there about half full. Um, okay then. Dan, it's what, he, it's what he's using to intentionally blacklist. <coughs> it's what he's using as a code word, Dan. Thomas gets to cook Thanksgiving dinner. That sounds like fun. Two 700s and three quad tracks. Very nice, Mitch. They wouldn't have an 800 flow tech. They literally don't even sell the 800s in, in Europe. Am I Irish? Yes. Hey, Jack. Hello, Baroness. You're calling it LS 2017. You're probably uh, aus Deutschland. In which case, the uh, gates. Have you missed much? Not much. Um, I've just pulled the hay bales in out of the field and now we're desperately trying to give the cows enough silage. We're about to Arden, Tipperary. Sounds like someone's like, yeah, that's my mother who's still got her cough. Like two or three weeks later. Someone dying in the background. Yeah, everybody's got a cold here. Everybody. So, there's been a lot of coffee going around this house. Yeah, the 800 doesn't meet EU regulations at all. Holy cow, I made so much silage. And it's still not apparently enough. Dave. Hey, I'm not the one who brought the cold into the house. Don't leave the house enough to bring stuff in. Where is me refill? Where's me refill? I should have done this before the stream, but I just need to refill my uh, e sig because it's practically empty. When simulating streaming, I've no idea. <laughs> He's been very, very difficult to get in contact with even the last week or two. Um, hello, Fahey. Are you free from Spudnet? Or are you still on Spudnet? Who is Simulate? Are you seriously asking that, Lars? I'll be genuinely surprised if you don't know who Simulate is, because... Um, <laughs> he's kind of been a bit of a big name over the past couple of weeks, months. When's Faye going to put up a video? Uh, when he gets 500 subs, he'll do a face reveal. So subscribe to Faye now for uh, that face reveal. Simulate now. Um, he still t he still no, he still simulate at the moment. But um, I don't know what the future is going to bring there. It's 
Honestly, don't know what the future hold it holds there. Hey, I filled this feeding trough. Please go to the correct side. Thank you. Does he have to change his name? He might. Um, we're trying to convince him to fight it. But, um... I don't know what the full story is as of quite yet. Same as just that gaming to his name. It is Simulate Gaming. <coughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I've got a highlighted part of chat now. How did I think of my YouTube name? It's actually two, um... Two nicknames just thrown together haphazardly. What's happening with Simulator? Basically, he's... He's being forced to change his name. Um, he's, I think he's got a video up on it, and I don't know what he said. But he has to change his name uh, for... Reasons. Uh, I'm not going to go into it too much. I don't know what he said on it, and I don't want to... To... Uh, say too much myself. I'm sorry, I'll... Uh, <clears throat> I'll tell you a bit more after the stream, Hamster. Yeah, um, I encourage you to watch Simulate's latest video. Basically, that has a story. Hey, Bruce. Gonna make me some extraction. Where did I put the shovel? There it is. Can why don't be for PS4 too? I'm not the person to ask. Fusion. Um, you have to ask Nathan. Who made the map? I'm just testing it. <coughs> what do the cows actually in water straw grass? <coughs> hey, Magnus. When I do MP streams, I join the Discord. Probably not, just because it's but it's difficult enough trying to keep everything together as is without having Discord. On top of it all. Uh, does this provide a mixing ratio, please? So we do actually technically have mixed r rations right here, right now. Uh, but I'm going to put in a bit more silage. Just to kind of beef it up a bit. Hey, Thomas. How are you doing today? When are we going to start multiplayer simulator fight? Uh, when we can get things arranged and when there's a, a mod map r around. Yeah, Kelly, and that's pretty much one of the reasons is I kind of need to have uh, control over the language being used during the streams. 
and um, the only way I can do that and guarantee that the language will be uh, acceptable to me is by being the only one talking. Which is a bit of a shame, but that's the way it has to be. So that should be the cows are breaking. Oh, they're very good at doing poses. That should be them good on mixed rations. That's almost no mixed rations. <laughs> Hang on, how's that only 2892? There's a full bale in that. <coughs> hey, boss, have you missed much? Not a lot. Let's, I guess, go grab more bales and throw them in and see what happens. Hey, Miles. Welcome along. I need to double check. Double check stuff. Um, I guess, because that looked a lot more full than 2800. But TMR is power food, by the way. And you just uh, drive a bit to the trap. Yes, but I'm making TMR. From Lithuania. Very nice. Okay, so I can put, I can put two bales in. So let's get a second hay bale. And... Is Nathan at any fast street? I don't know. I haven't actually looked. Um, I think there, I think there is a forestry area. <coughs> I think there is. Now I'm, I'm pretty good today. Um, as you can probably hear, my cough is kind of waning, it's starting to go away. Ooh. Please tell me that thing has collisions, because that would be perfect for this. Perfect. What's my favourite tractor? Um, Massey 135 has to be. In game it's either the track challengers, either are. Uh, An FS19, I don't think there should be an FS19, Miles. I think they should skip it and just go straight to 21 with a new engine. Um, I, don't, I don't see the point in them going to 19 with the same engine again. They, That's the next thing they need to change, is the engine. You're back. Welcome back, Zoe. Oh, this thing does have... So, uh, customizable steering. That's quite nice. Although, why you'd take it off all wheel steer, I don't know. <coughs> oh, good.
Hello, Virtual. How are you doing today? What else am I doing in the stream? Uh, I don't know, boss. I'm kind of coming up with plans as I go along. Ideally, yes, Chris. I'd, I'd prefer to wait four years for farm sim with a new engine than two years for farm sim in the same engine that's been modified again. Because they're, they're still using the same engine as farm sim 09. Like, that's... It's a very old engine now. Is the Landy free? Um, the Land Rover is available on Mod Hub, is that, if that's what you're asking. It is. You don't have to pay for it. Right, this should be good TMR or Power Food or whatever they want to call it next time around. What am I streaming till? Uh, Seven o'clock ish. GMT. The Land Rover is public. That's a public Land Rover. <clears throat> I might do a bit of a reskin job on it, but it is a public Land Rover. Welcome back, Amster. Dang it. This is ridiculously tight. I'm clearly take, trying to take the turn a lot tighter than it should be taken. There we go. Cows can't bloody complain about this now, can they? Sure, they'll find a reason to. Oh, it's boosting up the silage. For some reason. Okay. What am I doing after this? I don't know. <laughs> um. <coughs> what do you like the most about the game? Uh, I don't, ooh, that's a good question. I don't know what I like the most, but I do like the uh, the wheel shader, the way that works. So I'm going to be a bit lazy here and just bring the uh, entire mixing wagon into the field. Grab the uh, straw bales. <laughs> oh dear. Are you serious, hamster? That's kind of bad. Uh, t you thought TMR was hey strong size. Straw in TMR is just used as kind of a filler. It's not necessary, Mitch. No joke. Oh dear. <laughs> He's shooting for the moon with that one. Oh, how have I managed this? Uh, what time am I finishing at 7 o'clock? It's a solid question there, I can't remember who asked it. You can't use straw and silage to make TM, or... Uh, it has to be hay and silage. The straw is just a, a filler. <coughs> that kid's gonna get nowhere. Gonna be completely honest, just... I'm gonna, I'm gonna say something now, and some people might not like it, some people kind of agree, possibly. If you're advertising in other people's streams, like if you come in with the sole intention of saying, hey, it's up to me, I'm doing this or this or this, number one, you probably play Minecraft. 
Number two, you're probably about 12. And uh, number three, you're basically destroying your own name. It's, it's going to be counterproductive by doing that. If you see me in Landy's stream or anybody else's streams, I'm always just kind of... I lurk a lot of the time, yes, but when I do talk, it's like making a joke or... Or, um... You know, giving a bit of advice to somebody or answering a question or... Just saying hello, even. Just being casual and chatty and... Not advertising. <laughs> and honestly, that's... If you want to advertise on a stream, the best way to do it is by not advertising and just chatting. It's a stereotype, but it is true. <coughs> and I do apologize to, to the 12 year old Minecraft players out there. Um, not all of you are the same, but the unfortunate truth is a lot of people who make YouTube videos and do that. Um, are very young and they play Minecraft. 90% of the people that I've seen advertising on my videos and streams like that have been very young and play my... What the blue neck is... Oh, they've been throwing... They've been throwing their food out already. That's that done. Where's the, um... Where's the manure go? That's something I don't know. I probably should know. Where does the manure generate? What's annoying is, in the past, I could just look for the plane that I four, but I can't now. It's actually a, a set of triggers. Out we go. There we go. There we go. Hopefully it's not going to generate over here somewhere. Because that would be kind of annoying. <coughs> there is a rule saying no shoutouts. That there is. I might grab the baler here and see if I can, uh... Yeah. I'm gonna do that, actually. I'm gonna see if I can bail up the straw. My console I'm on? PC. Um, I, I don't own a console. So, the only games I ever play are PC. I can't ba I I can't bail it. Is that a challenge? If so, I'm accepting that challenge, hamster. I know, Chris. I'm just ignoring it. You couldn't build it? Well, that's you, hamster. Let's see if I can get this. Hamster, you said you couldn't bail this. Hey, Scania. I'm just doing some uh, bailing, as you can see.
that begs the question, can I bail the silage? <laughs> I may or may not be a bit stuck here. May or may not be very stuck here. May or may not need to get. Where did they put me, other thingy? Kramer! The Massey needs your assistance. <coughs> <coughs> Must have just been the square vader. Do you want me to check that too, hamster? Okay, I've poked it about seven times, that should have helped. There we go. I'm, I'm fully expecting to see some questionable re responses to that one in the comment, in the, uh, <laughs> the chat in a second. Hey John Deere fan. Where did I get the map? Nathan sent it to me. Um, it's not available at the moment. It's not publicly available. Um, I'm testing it for him. And annoying hamster by actually being able to bail this, this stuff. That's actually really convenient, I have to admit. <laughs> How does poking this tractor seven times help it? I don't know, but it did. What do I think about John Deere? I think uh, people who like John Deere may be a bit fanatical about it. <laughs> I think Hamsters just quit as a mod. Because I made fun of him. Well, you were wondering how I could bail this, so... It does appear that I can't bail the silage, though, which is a bit of a shame. And you, you claimed, did you not, that I could not bail this? Hey, Crafty Matter. Welcome along. That said, I am kind of surprised that uh, <laughs> I, I could actually bail it. <laughs> Solo game. Um, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna give the map, the map out. It's up to Nathan to give it out. Um, I'm sure if he wanted to do a multiplayer test that he'd uh, or if he wanted me to do a multiplayer test he'd, test, he'd ask and tell me he was going to be involved and whatnot. So, not that big a deal. <laughs> um, like to subscribe. Thank you very much, Crafty. Welcome back, Angus. Let's find somewhere to stack these things. Um, it makes some sort of sense. I 
I guess here will do. In between these trees. So kind of lay out a boundary with vertical bales. Let me stack all of them vertically, to be honest. That <laughs> ain't incorrect, yeah. You subscribe? Thank you very much, Zoe. Am I on PC? Yes. Um, I'm running a few scripts at the moment, so... This is definitely PC only. And I'm testing a map, so... You can the one downside to consoles is... Um, you guys won't ever get maps to test. Ever. You won't get kind of beta stuff that could be a bit broken. <coughs> You're all the stuff you... Well, it's an upside, I guess. Um, but you guys will never know the fun of trying to diagnose what's broken a mod. <laughs> See you, Jacob. Have a good rest of your day. Good, have a good evening. You just subscribe. Thank you very much, Kyron. Here. Uh, crafty by not asking. <laughs> That's actually one of the rules, so you've clearly not read them. You gotta go, Arrow? Well, I hope you have a good evening, good night, and good morning tomorrow, good afternoon tomorrow, and uh, a fun time all around. <laughs> Rule number one of being a moderator, don't ask to be a moderator. <coughs> Early spring already? <laughs> yeah, it's the... <coughs> the uh, season script from SOB modding. It does basically nothing, it just allows me to... It just gives kind of a season that it currently is, and you deal with it. Get mods. I've got mods. Um, there's not that many mods available at the moment. Well, not that, that many good ones anyway. Can I get weights for the telehandlers? Yes, but this isn't a telehandler. This is actually regarded as a front loader. It's too small to be a telehandler. This is just kind of a yard loader. against gates. It's too far away. The gate's all the way over there, and I'm only going from, like, here to there. Makes much more sense to just go through the hedge. Clearly. Do I like the... is the loader a mod? No, this is defaulting game, the Kramer. Um, completely default. It's a nice little machine as well. I gotta say, it is one of my favourite pieces of... like, all around, one of my favourite pieces of equipment in game. Just because it's a a good size and a good price, it's probably the cheapest you'll get a telehandler like piece of equipment for. This is only like what sixty thousand.
Good front heavy, yes. Does that arm boom out? Yeah, it does. You can uh, boom it in and out and shake it all about if you want. It is basically a mini telander. The only difference is it uses front loader equipment. Like it uses the front loader tools. Which is why it's regarded as a front loader. Hey, Ryan. You gonna use this for forestry? Can't see I can't see this being much use for forestry. I'm gonna be honest with you. Then again, you can get a forestry skid steer, so... You gotta go, Zoe? Well, I hope you enjoy the rest of your evening, the rest of your day. Have a, a very good night as well. <coughs> hey, Crypto. Oh, welcome along. TNT skipping school. Naughty girl TNT. <laughs> I bet you did school because Justin Bieber's about it and you want to meet him. Handles logs better than the telehandlers. Anything can handle logs better than the telehandlers can. Yeah, Bale Second is always seconds away from disaster and anger. Uh, that said, this seems to be the last Bale. So it looks like this stack is going to go up without much of a problem. And of course the last bale doth protest us. <coughs> Here we go. Right, next job is... What is the next job? Oh, I know what the next job can be. It's one of the best channels, if not the best. I disagree, Daniel, but I appreciate that. I think there's a lot of people out there that are me. Um, the next job is going to require the deer. Because we actually do own that field. And it requires, uh, if I double check here, does it require plowing? Yes, it does. This field, all four of these fields require plowing. So, let's, uh, go grab our plow. Actually, 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 can I afford to do this? <laughs> can I afford to do this? <clears throat> At least this. And, uh, let's lease this. Actually, let's lease this thing. Because it's 5.7 meters. And it's yeah. technically a plow. Uh, let's actually return to the John Deere for a second, turn that off. Get the Challenger on. Get head tracking on. There we go. So the reason I'm using the Challenger is to annoy people. The 
The reason I'm using this ridiculously huge cult uh, plow is that I didn't realize it was actually this big. Oops. <laughs> um. <laughs> I can't. I can't fit down the road. Hey, buddy. <coughs> Welcome back, Ace. Hello, Alistair. Yeah, I'm gonna have to cut through the hedge here. Just out of necessity, I'm gonna have to cut through the hedge. So this should take the... This should get the plowing done in no time at all. Let's uh, lower our... Plow, of sorts. Yeah, this is gonna be... A nice, easy bit of work. Oh, yes, beacon's on, I forgot. Coming through the hedges. Yeah, I kind of had to because I didn't realize this thing was actually too wide for the roads. Um, subscribe. Thank you very much, buddy. This thing can plow at 10 kilometers an hour. That's quite fast. My streams are the best. And I, I lied? What do you mean I lied? I said I wouldn't get another 800. And I also said I wouldn't buy a Challenger. I'm leasing this one. I've, I've rented it. I was up with the fake Banky thing. Uh, somebody decided to be funny to make a server claiming to be the Banky. Um, so... <laughs> uh, on TeamSpeak, we all kind of agreed it'd be really, really funny if um, the real versions of all of us showed up and taught fake Banky a lesson. <laughs> the same when I play together. Occasionally, yeah. Um. When we're both free at the same time, we try to arrange you know, some casual play thing. Um, okay, you know, from time to time. But you know, it's just we're all, we're working on our own projects at the moment, and it's very time-consuming. You're going to work in an engine that's leaking gas everywhere. Well, remember, the best way to figure out where the problem is, is to use a lighter. <coughs> Alistair, I completely agree with you there. Um, the reason I'm using this... ...is because I'm quitting smoking. That's just to get some nicotine into uh, my system. Can I do a whole episode but change my name on FS17? Well, on the fake Banky server that is probably down now because we wrecked the map. <laughs> Because that was only 20 minutes ago. We were on that map for almost an hour. Is using a lighter dangerous? Yeah, it tends to be around petrol. Ace. Uh, basically, I made a joke at TNT saying, set yourself on fire. Did we cut down all the trees? No, he kicked us like three times before we got them all down. Then he sold the chainsaw. <laughs> <coughs> he 
Is this a plow? Yes. It's a chisel plow. Um, and I have seen these in use in Ireland. So this isn't too unrealistic. The size of it, yes, but the actual basic function, not so much. Hey, Asman, welcome back. Turn too tightly there. Get more massies. I plan to. Hamster, we did that too. Faye knows what's up with those rules. Hey, monster. Um, yeah, every piece of equipment, every vehicle on that map ended up underwater. Um, and when they realized we were about to throw the last few pieces in, they shut the server down. <coughs> so, uh, hopefully it hasn't gone back up since. If it has, I thoroughly encourage you to go griefing. These plows are actually really good. This is the first time I've used one of them. And, uh... I do, pr I do genuinely prefer um, the traditional moldboard plows, but chisel plows are also good, especially if you're in a bit of a rush. Because you don't have to worry about, oh, am I turning tightly enough here? Am I giving myself enough room? Uh, Ace, I've already answered that question. The answer is no. There won't ever be. Where did I get this plow? It's on the mod hub. Um, it's on Giant's Mod Hub. I think it's down as a subsoiler, but it is a chisel plow. Well, it is actually a subsoiler, because if I bring it up out of the ground here, you'll see. It's not really a plow as such, it is genuinely a subsoiler, it's just acting like a chisel plow in game. <coughs> Which is perfectly fine, I mean, I can accept that happening. Why? Um, Xbox 360 just can't support them, in all honesty. An Xbox 360, if you try to run even the smallest plow um, or the smallest maps, it would struggle. Yeah, chisel plow leaves stripes in the field. Oh. So a chisel plow is actually just what we'd call a subsoiler over here then. We have a likes spike only 30 at the minute. Come on, guys. Let's try and get 50 likes by the end of the stream. We got three quarters of an hour to do it. I think we can get another 20 likes by the end of the stream. Yeah, Xbox 360, it's just... It's not set up for um, modding. The Xbox One is barely set up for modding. <coughs> and uh, Microsoft are kind of crippling even that. Turned in the wrong direction there. There we go. There we go. I don't think you guys can complain too much about me doing ploughing when it's actually different ploughing. What cultivator is that? This isn't a cultivator, this is a plough. This is the... Uh, Jimpa. <laughs> Jimpa SJ11SR from uh, Giant's Mod Hub. 
I don't know if it's on console. But these fields do need to be plowed, and this is the quickest way to do them. I go down this side, why not? Yeah, this is why you play Farm Sim on PC. And by the way, the tractor I'm using is in fact the Field Viper. The uh, MT757, yeah, 755 Field Viper. <coughs> How long have I been streaming? Uh, just under an hour and 20 minutes. See you, Mitch. Enjoy the rest of your day. Uh, so I do stream every day. And I just do my best to keep it family friendly. I do apologise for coughing at the moment, by the way. I am kind of coming over the tail end of a cold. It's a nice structure. It is. I do like... This is the kind of challenger you'd see in the UK. The 700 series. Which is still huge, but... It's not as big as the 800. Do I know if Landy's on Chellington tonight? Uh, I don't know. Is he streaming tonight? I don't know. Um, I don't know. I don't know what Landy's plans actually are for anything. Does not be out for consoles? I think Nathan said he's going to try and get it out for consoles, but there's no guarantees. But I preferred the 800. I do now. The difference is the 800 isn't a UK isn't a realistic tractor for the UK. Um, so on British maps I'll be if I get a Challenger it'll probably be the 700. Um, and that's assuming I even get a Challenger I might decide to go Fent. Hey Owen! I might d decide to go with a, um, a Fent 9 900 series or a Massey 8700 series. Um, there's no guaranteeing I'm gonna go with the Challengers all the time. Really looking forward to the release. Um, yeah, it's going to be a good map. Just I'm not going to say... Yeah, I'm not going to say what I was going to say. Never mind. <laughs> There's a... Oh, I will say. Oxygen David, I've been told, has been doing a lot of work on it. And has um, been quite busy changing up sections of the map a bit. Just to get him working a bit more... Uh, efficiently and get them working better so it is looking to be a good map I don't know if I'm gonna play it personally <coughs> just because there will probably be other maps out around the time that Oxygen David releases Cheldon and I can't predict um, what maps I'll be on or whether I'll have a, a gap in my schedule so to say have I tried out the 900 series challenger? No, I haven't actually. So let's go on a bit of a plowing frenzy. Let's get all of our fields plowed up. And uh, this is the this is the really nice thing about the new leasing system is you can get vehicles that you pro you can't afford and equipment that you can't afford and get stuff done really quickly. What other maps will be released? Um, I don't know, Andrew, but it's getting into that time period where the first really big maps are going to start coming out. Um, Jellington might be the first, I don't know. Hey, Christopher. If you're correct, that sounds like Tank Tour. This is not Tank Tour. This is the MT-700 series. Um... It's a uh, tank to a smaller brother. How many horsepower? I don't know. <laughs> um, <coughs> 755 is 384 horsepower. And the plow requires what? 375. So we're 
nine horse over what we need. Do I know about Nuston? I know about it, I don't know... Like, I know it's being converted and worked on, I don't know anything in detail. Where's the Ireland am I from? Tipperary. County Tipperary, and I'm not going to say where exactly. Hey, Jesses. And Dylan. Dal, did I forget to say hello to you today? If so, I do apologise. Bring some Holland. Hello. Holland. I was going to try and read your name, then I realised it's just a random collection of letters. <laughs> yes, I did. I do apologise, Dal. Good lord. I feel so rude. I can't hear a vacuum cleaner. I thought I was going crazy. <coughs> um, I'm not going to do much silage on this map just because the silage bunkers are a bit small, bit broken at the moment. Um, I know what the problem is, I know how to fix it. Uh, I do believe Nathan is aware of this. What's hoovering? What's funny, hamster is... If... I'm guessing correctly, it should, uh, there's no hoovering actually going on. It's just using vacuum pa uh, vacuum bags. You know those bags that you can vacuum seal? Have I seen any good combine mods? Not as such. Uh, you've got the fend pack on Giant's Mod Hub. And that's about it. Um, there's no, unfortunately, very f few, if any, uh, good combine mods out at the moment. I'm gonna have to mention this weird terrain flicker to Nathan. Unfortunately. Do I have any animals on this map? Yes, I've got cows. I've got literally some cows, I can't remember how many. Uh, but they are gonna start reproducing now that they're pretty much at, full, at um, full health, I guess. Full productivity. I'm going to plough this way. Because why not? Why not plough differently? <coughs> it's funky stuff, yeah. It looks... Almost as if na that's a giant editor issue again. Um, I might be able to get that to fix itself. Hang on, what happens if I turn on that? That. So if I keep this at this angle here, just run over this section here. Does that solve the issue or no? No, it is a game glitch. Okay. It's a glitch with the game. Cows take a really long time to reproduce. They do, actually. Um, it's a bit of a shame. Pigs, though, I've heard they're like rabbits. They're terrible for uh, just reproducing non stop forever. Wait, oh, that is so pretty. I'm going to have to turn on screenshot mode here. Because that is just so... I'm actually going <coughs> to... This... I swear, the evening sky in this game makes everything beautiful. It's just, it just looks so good. Once a map is uploaded to FSUK or any site, how long does it take them for, for them to release? Once it's on FSUK, it needs to be tested, Andrew. The same with Giants Mod Hub, usually. 
Um, and testing can take up to a week. How did I get this menu up? Client settings? There's the game extension by Zentro, available on madcentral.co.uk. And that was a beautiful screenshot. Pigs are really fast. Two hours in your game. I've heard of them, like, doubling overnight, almost. Like, the more pigs you get, the faster they reproduce, and it's a, a vicious circle of, like, infinite pigs forever. <coughs> Which I guess is great if you want slurry. Um, it's a, a good strategy to go for, for lots and lots of slurry. Good evening, Paddy. What's client mode? Client settings here. It's, um... Turn off screenshot mode and turn the crosshair back on. Turn that back on. There we go. It's game extension it allows me to sit on screenshot mode and whatnot. And also determine how expensive hard workers are and a few little things like that, which is really nice. Just little little details like that make uh, a mod great. And there are plans, I believe, for future kind of updates to the mod to add more stuff, as, uh, even you know, even more stuff than what's currently in it. Because right now, if I want, I can set it so that I can lift bales. Um, and through some testing, I've discovered the weight limit of what I can lift, even with this mod installed. And the like lifting limit effectively removed. Uh, the limit's about four tons. Uh, it's on modcentral.co.uk. Uh, you do have to register to download it, but it is very, very much, very worth going on to. That's where the SOB former OEB guys live. So. If you like the SOB, the OEB mods, the SOB team is uh, what you want to be with now. They're the guys you want to follow. They've got some interesting stuff already. And I'm sure they'll have some even more interesting stuff. Lift by hand, yeah. You can... Hang on, I'll... I'll uh... Hmm. Yeah, I'll hop over here real quick. So if I go over here and set my... What's my lift scale at the moment? Let's set this all the way up to... F oh, it's maximum. Let's set it up to 10. Like that. If I walk over here... I can... Uh, Stack the hay bales by hand if I really want. <laughs> Just lift them off the trailer. And even throw hay bale. Pick it off the trailer. Throw, throw the hay bale. Pick it off the trailer. Throw the hay bale. Pick it out of the dumpster here. Get out of the dumpster. Thank you. Throw the hay bale. Which I guess is good if you want a really specific stack done. But uh, by and large it serves no purpose. So let's set this back to... Uh, 1. Which is the default. And off we go again. Ended up being the Land Rover mod causing it. Oh! Could be, Paddy.
This map does have errors anyway, this, um, the current version that I have. <coughs> so, this map is, is not ready for release. There's some fairly big issues with it at the moment. Hello, Luke, how are you doing today? The game extension script is really useful if you want to, um, you know, move pallets about real quick, and you can't be bothered getting a forklift or something over to them. Just allows you to to um, get them on the move really super quickly. If you're wondering why I'm plowing, I've got forced plowing turned on because I'm insane like that, I guess. It does, yeah, this is showing up like the Giants Editor glitch, and it, it, it's almost identical to that glitch. Which isn't really a glitch, it's just a... Uh, yes, hamster. I do. I go in the cab, yep. You can go in cab and do some work in here. Uh, what about that, that item? Does that cause this problem? It could be that it's an old script causing some issues. I'll have a look inside this Land Rover mod later on and see <coughs> see what the deal is. Hey, Max, how are you doing? You're not related to Mark Webber, are you? The uh, former Formula One driver. Former, uh, former racing driver, he's he's retired now, which is a real loss for racing as a whole, I think. Motor racing needs a straight-talking Australian bloke at the top somewhere. So I hope he, like, takes over the FIA in some sort of weird coup. Um... You'd need to get the original mod author's permission, Hamster, but I'd have no issues with you doing it. If you can find the original mod author, then yeah. Um, am I going to plant after? Not today, but we will be seeding these fields up. Farmson sounds are the best sounds. The sounds are amazing now in Farmson, I will admit. Because this does actually sound like ploughing does. <coughs> hey, sorry. Will I be streaming tomorrow? Yes. Don't know what I'll be streaming, but I will be streaming tomorrow. You took one mod out at a time until bingo. Uh, what mod was causing it? Was it the 190 that's on Giant's Mod Hub? Because I can swap that, ba swap that out real quick. Uh, what am I doing next? Probably gonna end the stream after all the plowing's done, to be honest. <coughs> you see, it could be Faye, but at the same time, Giant's editor reloads that, and Giant's engine reloads that when you load in. So that wouldn't be the issue. Um. Hey, pro gamer. What have we missed? Uh, fed the cows, for the most part. 
I have... I fed the cows and, and stacked up some bales and now I'm doing plowing. It's the Land Rover 109 with the PTO. Okay, so it is the Land Rover I have. Alright, I can get rid of that. What am I doing after plowing? Probably ending the stream because we've got... Uh, a, well, we've got more fields to plow yet. I want to get all these fields planted up. Hello, Ford 7740. Um, I want to get all the fields ploughed and planted up. I will be doing some of this off camera. Don't you worry. And uh, I'll also also uh, make a test save with just the uh, Land Rover 109 and see what happens. Can I shout you out? No, don't ask for them. <laughs> Your lucky hamster got there first, because uh, you might not have been so lucky otherwise. <laughs> Bloody annoying looking for mispatches, and you can, all you can see is green. There we go. Am I? I'm doing good. Um. Just getting over the tail end of the cold, so I got a bit of a residual cough. It's not as bad as it was the last couple of days, which is always nice. It's always nice to, like getting over the tail end of a cold and the residual cough is going away and you can actually breathe again somewhat and not worry about laughing. Yeah, I love the menus. Yes. Yes, hamster. And I hate that it's copyrighted music because um, there's a reason I always start the game when I've got the map loaded up. Or start the stream when I got the map loaded up. That's because I don't want to get content ID'd. Because um, content ID on a stream? I've been done for six seconds in a six hour stream before. Um, <laughs> I'm sure it's not a vaping cough. It probably is a combination cough. Um, But honestly, I prefer vaping cough over the cold cough. <coughs> hey, Brandon. And Germans here as well. Lurking away. Doing, doing his best Dave impression. Okay, I, I, I will admit, I am now officially a fan of chisel plows. I always thought they were kind of a cheap way of getting around plowing, but now that plowing isn't forced, um, it's definitely something good. Do you need heaps of horsepower to pull up hill while planting or while plowing? No, I've only got nine horse over what it recommends, and it's doing quite well. Um, it's probably a bit big for this style of map, though. But the uh, 700 series, any 700 series, can pull this. Yeah, I'm probably gonna get rid of the Land Rover. Wonder if Fresh is lurking. I wouldn't be too surprised. You never know who is lurking. You know. For all I know, Chris, you know, PewDiePie could be lurking here for some strange reason. You know, I've just as much of a clue as who, of who's lurking as you do. Yeah, for, for all I know, PewDiePie watches these streams daily. And just never talks. For all I know, Keanu Reeves is here. Leo's lurking. How do you get game extension to work? You install it, hamster. <laughs> hope he's been a lot better. I hope he is too. Um, the last... <laughs> <coughs> oh, sorry. The last stream I did where he was here didn't didn't really help him all that much because 
He was apparently in stitches with me going slightly insane. Seven more likes till 50. We're gonna... Got 20 minutes to hit, to hit 50 likes, guys. Come on, let's see if we can do it. You fully taken out a mod folder rather than just deselecting it. Uh, no, because deselecting it disables the mod entirely. It doesn't even look at the zip file. I do like the way mods are done now. You don't need a mod manager anymore. Done. Are we at 50 likes? I know I'm a bit lower energy than usual, that's because I'm trying to keep my voice. Good to know, yeah, um, it's basically running the same kind of methods that old mod, mod managers did. <coughs> where, uh, or mod managers, where it just, it kind of has a look at the zip file when you're loading into the game. It says, oh, there's a mod here. And uh, after that, if you say, oh, I don't want to use this, it just closes out the zip file and acts as if it doesn't exist at all. What form of implement is this? This is a chisel plow, Ruben. It's, technically it's a subsoiler, but it's working as a chisel plow. Um, and I'm just using it because I wanted to use something different. I always use the offset plows. Always, always, always use moldboard plows, traditional moldboard plows, and I want to use something a bit different, so chisel plow today. Just because... I don't know, because it's, it's, it's different, it's nice. The ones that I go hyper are the ones you like. I do, I don't always go hyper, Chris, but when I do, it's very hyper. Can I stop plowing and do something else? Uh, like what, Ryan? There's not a whole lot else to do at the moment, unfortunately. Um, like, I, I can't... I literally cannot sell crop. There's no crop sales on the map. Um, I can't do anything to the cows. They're all sorted for a while. I can't do fertilizing as such. I can't do seeding. Cut down trees. I, I guess I could. But honestly, I'd prefer to get all this sorted in one go. Um, I know that it's not the most exciting thing in the world, but it's... You know, you wouldn't s suddenly stop plowing to cut down six trees somewhere and then go back to plowing. Mo? In early spring? I mean, look at the time of, y look at the time of year the game is saying it is. It's early spring in game. Um... In winter and early spring, yeah, chisel plows are easier and faster, and I have seen them being used in Ireland as well. In in early spring, you wouldn't be doing much other than, you know, plowing cultivation. Um, wow, the desperados are out in force today. Oh my god, I get this one. Nope, I have still got there. <laughs> I'm gonna call I'm gonna call people to do that desperados from now on. <coughs> Cause they're just they come across as being completely desperate for subscribers. <laughs> um I don't mean it as an insult, but it's the impression you get. Hamster's grabbing food. Shove it in your cheeks, hamster, you'll be fine. So we got about, uh, what, 15 minutes of stream left. What challenger am I using? I am using the MT700 Field, field Viper in the uh, 5.5 configuration, which has 384. Five horsepower. C 
see him land. Uh, but I am gonna play this as realistically as I can. I know that I do some, I, I know that I do a lot of silly stuff, but in terms of the field work, I am gonna play this map and all maps kind of seriously. <coughs> Where um, winter and early spring are basically plowing and and uh, whatnot. Pretty give out to them in fresh eggs stream the time out. Oh, Chris, they don't get timed out here. They don't. They don't get timed out. They get completely nuked. Nice director, thank you very much, Debbie. I do. I have to admit, I do like the seven hundred uh, challengers as well. They're like eight hundreds, except a bit more compact. Um. I guess that's the whole point. Is the seven hundred is a, a, a just a smaller version of the eight hundred. Although I have to say, how weird would these look with wheels? Like, how wrong would a Challenger look if it had wheels? They're banned? Yeah? Chris. <laughs> if they're gonna show me that much disrespect, and it is disrespect that they show, then they don't deserve to be able to talk here. <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna be that rude and that disrespectful they don't earn any of my respect and they lose so much of it that I don't want to see them again uh, Fresh probably ain't streaming tonight he's, he's probably not gonna stream for a bit hello Jake <coughs> you've never seen a plow like this before George and yet, I don't live in the countryside, and I have. How odd. Hey, Welsh. Nice to see that you did actually finally fi find the password to your account. Either that or you hacked yourself. Hmm. On your way to the family's Thanksgiving. Ooh, very nice. Tomorrow is Thanksgiving in America, I completely forgot, so, uh, I guess in advance is that, of that, happy Thanksgiving, guys, for those of you living in the States, hope you've had a, a nice day, yes, will I be chilling out in Discord, um, I'll be doing many things later, German. Uh, Chris, it's up to Fresh what he wants to do to him. My personal opinion is they don't deserve to be able to chat. <coughs> but each individual streamer is going to have their own individual take on that. What time does the stream start? 5 o'clock? What time is it ending? 7 o'clock. It's going to end about 10 minutes. So, coming up towards the end of it. Because um, I've got a list. I've got a list of things that need to be done today. Um, and it's it's not short uh, by any means. Will I start at 4 tomorrow? If I'm up in time, George, yes. Today I was, was going to start at 4 but then I didn't get out of bed until 4. Um when I have free time, I will be chatting in, in the general chat over in Discord. Why is the grass popping up in the field? I've managed to break it somehow. Thank you very much, Mark. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Um, there's a mod conflict already. Apparently, the Land Rover I have is causing a mod conflict. Oh, it's conflicting with the terrain somehow. And causing a bug, so... Um, I'm probably going to get rid of the Land Rover, unfortunately. And hope that that fixes the issue. Uh, let's spin this around again. The reason that I use challengers for plowing, by the way, is because they can basically turn on themselves. 
There's no real worrying about a turning circle as such. You're modding for your streams. Chris, that's not the way how you should feel when you're moderating, but okay. Then again, I, when I moderate, it's usually just hitting one button. <laughs> I, I normally just hit one button and I'm done. You're gonna get the Land Rover? Apparently that has an issue. That has issues with the game. It's <coughs> all so that green stuff a problem. Uh, another problem with the map, apparently it's a, an issue with a, a different mod that is somehow conflicting with terrain. Which I don't understand, but okay. Well done to whoever converted that Land Rover. You've managed to make it to make a mod that conflicts with literally everything. Uh, so I'll be uninstalling that mod later on if that is true. I'm just gonna give myself a bit of a headland here. What tractors do I have? I've got uh, this, I've got a John Deere 74 Five, thirty, uh, over in the yard there, and a Massey Ferguson uh, fifty-six thirteen, as well as the Kramer front loader telehandler magic thing, and the Land Rover that's causing this to happen. Can I moderate without using the mouse? No, no, you have to use the mouse, unfortunately. By one button, I meant there's literally one ma mod moderation tool that I use. <laughs> hey, crazy kid. It's a bit creepy to be saying that, but okay. Um, let's get all the lights on. I do like how the normal files now actually react to light. The way that, um... Do I know if you can get mods on Xbox and Playstation? Uh, FS17, yes. FS15, no. And the mods that you can get on PS4 and Xbox One are very, very limited. They're very limited. Because uh, Microsoft and Sony have to pass every mod through, and they're not allowing scripts, and they're not allowing this, they're not allowing that. Um, I think Giants have to have the licensing to any equipment mods, so don't expect to be seeing John Deere on console, ever. Uh, unless they rebadge John Deere as a lizard, then you might get into some luck. Can you get the map? Uh, this map isn't even available on PC yet, Pam. Um, this is effectively a beta version that Nathan sent me. And I'm kind of playtesting it for him. There are some minor issues, some more serious issues. Um, and he said he's working on fixing them. Check the beta. The beta section, yes, there's John Deere's in there. But I'm talking about consoles. Uh, on console, Giants have to own the license. Hey, John Deere fan. Uh, to put it on Mod Hub, you can have whatever. But to actually get them into the consoles, they have to be licensed equipment. Which is a real shame. What computer do I use to play FS17? It's a Rainbow Dave special. I call him Rex. <coughs> He's named after Rex from uh, from Mass Effect because he's just raw power. And I think uh, 
That should work. I think I've got a specs command. There's my computer in a nutshell. Do I like the age one twenty? I don't generally like John Deere's. Um, I just find them a bit bland, to be completely honest. They're not all that interesting. Yeah, Patty, basically they, they just... Because the way that mods work on console is they're basically free DLC, they... Giants have to own the license. Hey, Connor and Kieran, I, I don't own a car. I seem to be asked that increasingly often. I, I don't drive, I don't own a car. <coughs> As for scripts, it's just Sony and Microsoft saying, yeah, scripts can be used to make viruses. We're not allowing them. Which is fair enough, I guess. Do I have any hobbies? Um, this is somewhere in between a, a hobby and a full-time job, I see. Um... As for, like, proper hobby hobbies, um, honestly, playing, uh, messing about, tinkering with mods and maps and whatnot is, is a really nice hobby. It's probably my favorite hobby. And my least favorite hobby at the same time, because, oh, I hate edges so much. Ah. Somebody's lurking. Do I have a server? Um, on Saturdays I do, yes. I don't have a, a server up full time. If the person who's lurking would like to put moderator and then let me know if they're going to be on TeamSpeak in about 10 minutes. Um, no particular reason, I just want to chat with, you, with them because I with you because I haven't been in a while. Where can you find this map? You can't. Hey, you see the gaming guys. <coughs> Kieran, nope. Nope, that wouldn't... Uh, I can't see that happening ever. What's the server called on Saturdays? Uh, RDG Butterville. I host it myself, so it's only ever up for the duration of the stream. You watch me every day? Awesome. I haven't seen you here before. Unless you came in under a different name before. Only five more? Only five more what? At least the hedges are non-collidable. Uh, I'm not too good on that myself. Personally, I prefer collidable hedges. Hello, model farmer. That's my favorite tractor. Massey Ferguson 135. You couldn't watch before, okay. See you, George. Ow. Ooh. Now you can. Oh, awesome. <laughs> if you can't, that's fine, dude. Um, I just, I just want to catch up with you. Is is to be honest, because uh, I know you've been. Pretty busy lately. I've been pretty busy lately. That's <laughs> our times have not been kind to each other. <laughs> Thought it was a six nine eight. No, I prefer the one three five. Six nine eight's really good though. I'm sure Simulate's been working really hard on getting that working as well. But uh, that's gonna about do it for today now that this field is done. Because it is 7 o'clock. I do have a pile of things that I need to do today. <coughs> As Sim D lurks at the very end of the stream. <laughs> have I ever been fishing? No. But it is gonna do it for today. Um, I'm gonna do finish off the plowing kind of off camera. 
with this majestic setup. And, uh... <laughs> I'm gonna leave it here for today. Uh, I've been Rima Dave, you've been watching Farming Simulator 17 on White Oak, Farm Extended 17. Until next time, stay safe and goodbye.